Not exactly. Yeah, that dog it didn't have one leg, isn't it? It's okay. <laughs> just come on, I want to go. Hey, patience. Now, before we go, I'm gonna quickly explain to you on the pictures, and that's what you're gonna be doing. So you're gonna be doing some mini roundabouts, and all of them except one, you will always be following the road ahead. It's simple as that. So we're not gonna be doing any left turning. We're not gonna be doing any right turning on most of them okay? okay on the big roundabout just to rectify you whether you're going first exit ahead second exit ahead or third exit whichever you're going you always check your mirror as a signal however on the mini roundabout <coughs> if you're going straight ahead whether first exit or like first exit or second exit you don't need to signal so you need to controlling but again, you don't want to speed on the band though, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Now you got the two pictures. Again, I will show you guys as well. So we have got two roundabouts over here. On this first bottom one, if you're driving the white car and you're going straight ahead, which exit are you taking? The first? No, you're going straight ahead. Yeah. So which yeah. exit is this one according to this picture here? Oh. Um, second second because you have got a left turning yeah. there but as you're approaching on this bottom roundabout there is no right road so would that be classified as an open view roundabout or the closed view roundabout Close. there is no right you road can, you can see it, so, it's open. so that means you're looking there where the oncoming is so that means it's open yeah because as you're approaching you there is no right road there isn't it so you're simply focusing on ahead okay. now the next one let's say you have got a right road over there and this thumbs let's say is my a building over there so as you're approaching is your view open or closed then if there's a building over there on the closed. right correct so in that one you may want to stop even for a few seconds and do your ladder look assess decide and x you did this on like the bottom concrete correct you did this on the bottom of this roundabout remember you stopped you lean your body forward, you peep and creep if you needed to, and if nobody's coming, then you can go. Okay? So, we're going to do some mini roundabouts and the major roundabouts. Now, look how far. We need to be about a mile away, yeah? <coughs> what sign can you see ahead? Um, the triangle. Triangle sign. So, there's a warning sign the for the roundabout. The warning signs. And after that, what sign can you um, see? The mini roundabout. Well done. There you go. So, you can see. So, that where the sign is right underneath it you have got the roundabout yeah if you don't somehow we miss that uh, circle sign one more thing look at the road it's all clear but near there you will going to see a giveaway line that is also the clues for you okay so shall we do it yeah so let's drive off when you're ready please let's do this <laughs> so would you like me to talk you through more and or you want to do it by yourself um Whichever you like, I don't mind. I'll do it by myself. Good, well then, challenge yourself, okay. So because we have got a pause, yeah, check your blind spot again before you go. Well done, good to see you, good? Now push your speed first, that's more important. Progress is important because you're joining 30 miles per hour road, isn't it? Yeah? And you can cancel later on though. It does it itself, doesn't it? Well, Sometime, if you're still hearing the TikTok sound, then cancel by yourself. So I'm gonna keep it quiet. If I'm giving you no instruction, you're always following the road ahead. Well done, good. Well done, good, excellent work. So before pick up your speed, what you should do again quickly? Mirrors. And now pick up your speed, please. Talk to yourself, you can do self commentary uh, yeah. as well. <laughs> I'm just talking in my head. <laughs> yeah. Well done, sir. So this mini on the bout, slow down more, go around a little bit. Yeah, so there's no right road, yeah? open view and what's coming up again Another mini roundabout. but this time you have got cool. yeah. no 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 stop um. look at that car so it's, you, it's not even come round 
There you go. So, anybody from the right, okay, is important lesson for you. If they're coming and they're not signaling, don't go because we don't know where they're going. Or if right. they're signaling going this side, then you have to give it to them. Yes, if they're signaling going on the opposite side, then you can go. So, I'm going to talk you through. If you keep going after the traffic light, you got a blue sign there, means mini roundabout is coming. Yeah. So, start slowing down, Jensen. Gradually keep rolling. Reduce your speed. But it's an open view because there's no right road. Is that white car signaling? No. No. Glance your left and then try to go around a little bit. Is this a push and pull? Push and pull. And that's it. You don't want to speed too much as yet. You're still a beginner. Yeah? We just need to make sure that we control our steering there. So, good. You're doing good. Well done. Every seven to eight seconds, glance your center mirror and your speedometer as well. Now, looking ahead, after the street light, you go down the blue sign coming up with a three arrow. Yeah. So which roundabout is coming? Rene. Okay, so what we should be thinking about? Slow Going approach. Down. But as you're approaching, looking to where? Give it to you. All right. Gla anyone coming? No. So carry on. But you don't want to be keep staying to the right. Glance. Glance your right, look ahead. Glance your right, look ahead. <coughs> so the signs are very crucial, okay? When you're looking, look ahead as far as you can see now tell me what can you see ahead 30 and traffic lights okay and after traffic lights um with a mini roundabout yeah so okay. start thinking about it open view yeah. so anyone signaling going towards front of your road no so don't need to speed yet just go around it keep using your brake if i would you Ooh. yeah you see what i mean on a mini roundabout like that slow down then. <laughs> yeah you want to speed after when you have crossed the bend yeah not during the bend so again looking ahead what can you see roundabout. okay so and slow down and also open a closed view from your right closed yeah so go forward slowly lean your body towards the steering glance and look ahead anyone coming no that's it good and then gradually build up a speed well is that so now check your mirrors and gradually Come forward a little bit Bit more, bit more, and stop here. So they're turning, you got the blockers there. What should you do now then? Go. Go, yeah, come on. I'm going straight, I'm right. Yeah, no, you're turning left. Left, left, left. Where are you indicating? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And now what you're gonna do quickly? Hit mirrors. And uh, you know, last lesson, I remember you done this last lesson. Yeah. Right, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> if you're not sure, see where you're indicating as I know, well. I don't, it's weird, like, you left and right, just go off, don't they? It's, <coughs> that's first. happened. That's happened to more because you're concentrating so much. It's happened. Now we have got a mini roundabout coming up, and I would like you to turn left at the mini roundabout. First exit, please. Should I do it after this? So people of are. course, yeah, because if you signal now, people think you're turning next left, isn't it? So the timing of your signal have to be correct. No, that car is coming as well and so he is not signaling so he's not coming into our path the blue car but what about the right are they signaling no no so where are they going then Straight they're going follow our, uh, following our path so two cars rules as well look they're not signaling you know what i mean yeah I so if the two cars signaling going there then you can go it's okay relax so one car signaling the car behind is signaling yeah what about the red car no no so we need we can't risk it can we no so when the car's going up here we can't two cars yes yeah. the two cars are going because they come so fast you know what i mean and un unfortunately they do leave the signal a bit late as well though yeah yeah so creep your car forward a little bit more about here so you have a better view now It's okay. <laughs> just come on, I want to go. Patience. Patience is a, genuinely there is no gap over there. You can't risk it, can you? Yeah. So after the black car, look, it's nice and big gap over there. So after the black car, and that's your time to go over there. Looks ahead as well, and there you go. Were there any safe gap that time? Yeah. Where? So when you were turning left, were there any safe gap we could have used or not? Oh, I thought you, thought you meant to get up here. No, no, yeah. no. Before that, because we were waiting for <coughs> such a long no, time. No, there wasn't. That was so dangerous. So, exactly. Yeah, that's it. Relax. If I am the examiner, 
I would be very happy that you waited for the safe gap rather than rushing yourself. an excellent work good and good use of mirror there as you go you see start coming naturally now isn't it yeah it will become second nature that was a very good execution there well done Excellent. Well done. Good use of brakes there. Excellent work. Well done. <laughs> yeah, that dog it didn't have one leg, isn't it? Oh, 